hi my dear students i hope you are fine please uh, open your math books okay this is the summary of today's math class you need to open three pages page 67 68 and 69 okay today we learned about 2d and 3d shapes so don't forget to write the date and day on your math learners books okay so today we discussed three pages so in this in these lessons we talked about 2d shapes and identify number of sides okay you have to see the shape and count the sides so we practiced about uh, some 2D shapes. The first one is circle, that is 2D shape, square, rectangle, triangle, oval, okay? So these are the 2D shapes. This rectangle, sorry, this is a triangle that has three sides. This is a square that has four sides, four equal sides. This is a pentagon that has five sides. One, two, three, four, five. This is a hexagon that has six sides. Okay. So these yellows circles shows corners and the blue lines on each side shows slides okay sorry sides so three sides and three corner and we discussed about how many sides for the pentagon and hexagon we also talked about some 3d shapes the first one is cylinder 3D shapes means you can see the depth and length and width, okay? So cylinder, cube, rectangular, prism, sphere, pyramid, and cone. So let's find out how many vertices. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So this cube has eight vertices. So please look on the page 67 where you can find some 3D shapes. So you need to find where is the cube, where is the hexagon, okay? So here is the hexagon that has six sides, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, okay? And we talked about a triangle, one, two, three. So these shapes have sides and corners. Okay, we practice, you have to identify shapes. First one is oval. So you need to count how many ovals in this robot. So there is one oval that looks like an egg. How many triangles? There are only two triangles, this number one, the red, red one, and this number two. And square, there are only one square, equal sides. There are circles, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There are eight circles and there are 14 rectangles, okay? Sorry, rectangle. So rectangle means the two sides are short and two sides are long. They are not same. And we discussed some uh, directions. So we discussed about clockwise that move from left to right. The opposite of the clockwise is anti-clockwise that move from right to left. And we discussed half turn and the quarter turn. 
Now look at these examples for the clock. We have two clocks. So in this clock is the hands moving like clockwise. And this clock hands moving anti-clockwise. Okay. And we discussed that the quarter turn. Okay, so you have to revise the classwork. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye and take care.